This is energy diagnosis on an E90 model. So this is energy diagnosis on an E90 model. Energy diagnosis could be used to assist the technician in a battery drain or a current draw scenario. Determine the vehicle. Once identified, select service functions. Select energy diagnosis. Select start. So here we have the report of the energy diagnosis, starting from top to bottom in priority order. So first of all we have standard information, closed circuit current measurement. Closed circuit current measurement will give you the last 32 cycles of the vehicle sleep with anything that reached over 80 milliamps. Next up we have the battery. This gives you the current deduction of the battery over the last five days. It'll also tell you the current battery that's registered to the vehicle and the, la and the current mileage of the vehicle. Next we have the driving profile. This monitors the driver's driving profile and will show you how the, how the journeys have been carried out in the last 35 days. Last of all we have the stationary profile. Over an evaluation of 35 days, it will show you the distance travelled and the number of journeys that the mileage has changed. To exit the report, you can press the X in the bottom right corner. So here we have a breakdown of the energy diagnosis function. You can view the report. You can perform an analysis of the vehicle wake-ups. You can reset the closed circuit current monitoring cycles or you can log the function to send it to an autologic engineer. So here we can perform an analysis of the vehicle wake-ups. Here we have to accept and delete the last registered wake-up. The last wake-up has been deleted successfully. Now we have to switch off the Terminal 15 and Terminal R and leave the vehicle alone for an hour. So after leaving the vehicle for an hour, you would go back in and check the wake-ups in there you'll be looking for things that are not authorised to wake the vehicle. For example, the CAS, the footwell module and the junction box would be considered authorised wake-ups. Something like the PDC module would not be an authorised wake-up, which is common on this vehicle due to water ingress. If you'd like more information on this, please contact the Autologic Fault to Fix team.